Everybody, welcome back to the channel. My name is Paul Nguma, founder of Penology Lab. In today's video, I'm going to be sharing with y'all the top two stocks that all of you should be keeping in your watch list for today. And I'm also going to be answering some of you guys' questions for those of y'all who dropped your stocks of interest in the comment section of last night's video, right after the intro. All right, everybody. Again, before we begin, do not forget to annihilate the like button for the YouTube algorithm as always. All right. Right off the bat, we have the market right now. And for those of y'all who watched last night's video, I told you guys that I would not be surprised to see the market open higher at 0 0.4, uh, 0.30%. And right now we are at 0.4%. It exceeded my expectations, and honestly, I think it can go higher. I'm not bearish on the markets, all right? Um, keep the market in your watches for a potential loan. I think money would flood into this market. I don't think this is over yet. I think that this little cup and handle is going to break, and we're going to move up to our 3990 today, probably today, all right? So now let's talk about the main stocks, the top two stocks of this video the first one the first one is roku all right the first one is roku and i've seen some of y'all put down what do you think about roku i like roku i do like the way it's setting up and the reason why i like it is because of that morning star right here right there again and um, it's really really bullish at the moment and i don't think this is over yet i think a lot of money is to be made today and i think it's gonna push a lot higher towards at least um towards 345 dollars today i think so so keep that one in your watch list it's been crushed for quite some time and this recovery was imminent and this is like relatively speaking this is the bottom relatively speaking it actually bounced off of a previous level of support right over here and uh it's doing pretty well and there's also all of this room right there right all of this room right over here so long-term investors like i said in the past like few videos this is your time to shine this is where you go in with all of your cash and you buy and accumulate over time and you hold because that's what you guys do all right but for traders for traders there's some opportunity. There, there is an opportunity for us to make money on this one today. So uh, keep this one in your watches for a potential long. All right. Now, the next one that all of you should be keeping in your watches for today, um, that stock is TSM. All right. And TSM wants to pay us today. It really does. The reason why I say that is because of the 30 minute time frame and there is a reverse head and shoulders on here that broke through that neckline right over here and it wants to pay us. All right. It wants to pay us. So keep that one in your watch list uh, for today. I think it can run probably to like 126. Maybe even one, 125, maybe 126, maybe even higher. Who knows? I like it a lot. I like this one a lot. All right. Let me clean up this thing. And we're going to look at it from a bigger perspective. Yeah, this one is recovering as well. Not bearish on this one. Not at all. Nope. Definitely not bearish. Keep this one in your watches. Again, these are your top two stocks of the video. Now let's talk about you guys' stocks of interest. All right, the first one that we're gonna talk about is V, Visa. And Visa right now is behaving quite well after Regats or Doji, right? The Doji was two days late, that's fine. And then they performed afterwards, which is excellent, which is what we wanted. And I think that it can get in here and I think that it will get in here. I think that we will see 220. Not, I don't think it will, that will happen today. I think it's probably gonna happen on like Monday or Tuesday. Yeah. So um, I'm still bullish on this thing, still long on this thing. Very, very patient. Long term investors, dip buyers stepped up to the plate every single time. They just get buying it up, right? And the trend of the stock is upwards, people. Upwards, all right? So definitely keep 
um, Visa on your watch list. Let's see MasterCard. MasterCard is not doing well. Unfortunately, it's very unfortunately that this one is gonna take in a turn for the worst and it's not performing like Visa is. Visa looks way better and actually people who bought the dip actually made money. People who bought the dip on MasterCard kind of like are breaking even right now which kind of sucks and it does happen. This is the market. It happens people. It happens. Alright, so uh, keep that one in your watch list as well. Um, the next one that we will be addressing in this video, we're going to talk about Tesla. Alright, and for all of y'all who have been subscribing to the channel, who have been watching our previous videos, now, I told you guys, I think it was yesterday's, in yesterday's video that uh, in the morning and in the afternoon, that Tesla performed to perfection, right, to 670, and now it's opening higher, and I do think that we will hit 700, like today, I do. It, I would not be shocked to see 700 being hit today, maybe even 710 before this thing gets, right, super boring and goes sideways, so uh, yeah, I'm still long on this one, and anybody who's still long on this one, just don't get too greedy. All right, pay yourself some. It's very important. Paying yourself is very important. It's part of trading. All right, that's that's how you that's how you lock in gains and you make sure that you're not red at the end of the day. All right, so it's very important to pay yourself some money as it goes up. Um, the next one that we're going to be covering in this video, we're gonna talk about another stock that actually wants to pay us, which is A M A T which is the stock for yesterday's video. This stock is about to go parabolic, right? All types of clickbait in there. Yeah, um, so far it's opening up at 137. Again, like I said yesterday, like I said yesterday, it wants to go up to 145. It really, really does. And uh, we might we might see 142 today. And we, might see, we might see this thing go higher, especially if money floods in the market. This thing wants to push a lot higher. Uh, my thoughts and opinions on this parabolic move that's about to happen is not changing. It's really, really not. So keep that one on your watch list for today, all right? Now, there is one more stock that um, I addressed in the past that didn't perform as, it didn't go as low as I wanted, but due to the outlook on the overall markets and um, money flooding in, right, that stock is crowd, crowd strike. And there is a lot of short sellers trapped in here. And so far, it's looking pretty good for a long. It could go up to 195 today. Um, maybe even by next, maybe even by next week, Monday or Tuesday. I'm not bearish on this thing anymore. It's not, it's not going to get down here. Short sure, got trapped over here. All right. Um, I want it to be a little bit more picky, but again, money flooded in. The time to buy was yesterday. And then um, you can add on the way up again. It's not, the momentum is changing. The momentum is shifting. No more bears. All right. <laughs> no, no more bears. Um, the next one that we're going to be addressing is that apparently y'all, y'all been telling me that I see P M G is the Korean Amazon. Okay, that is that is news to me. All right, so uh, thank you all for letting me know what that is. And now that I know that, I'm really interested in the stock. All right, so uh, keep this one in your watch list. It's opening up higher with the market, and I think I think it will. It might even outperform the market. It might, it might go up to back up to like seventy dollars. Um, again, that option chain. The more, the more chain that they add to this, the more attractive this is to investors like myself or traders like myself, right? Long term investors, this you 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 are supposed to buy this thing if if you had high convictions about this company and you've done your due diligence, right? But for traders, I think there is an opportunity on this one, and uh, I don't think you should overlook this stock all right so uh, keep it on your watch list and that is the end of the video again do not forget to destroy the like button for the youtube algorithm as always it helps the channel a lot and it allows more people to get this knowledge as well also if you are new to the channel definitely click on subscribe and click on the notification bell along with all notifications that way you don't miss out on these pre-market analysis videos which are released from Monday to Friday at exactly 8.15 a.m. Central Time, 15 minutes before the market opens, and the post-market analysis videos, which are released every single day in the afternoon. If you're not following us on social media, 
You can find me at Paul and Guma and at Pedonology Lab on Instagram and on Twitter and Facebook also. Um, and lastly, if all of this is brand new to you, if you're brand new to this channel, if you're brand new to trading and you would like to get started, I left some step-by-step -step directions in the description of the video below. Step one to step three. It only takes about 15 minutes or less for you to get signed up with all the tools you need to start trading immediately. You can also get two free stocks valued up to $1,850 after you sign up with Weibull. Use my very first link in the description below. Once again, ladies and gentlemen, my name is Paul Nguma with Patternology Lab, where we trade patterns and patterns only. And I will see all of you in the next video, all right? Enjoy the outro.